Ashley Eskeva, and it's time for another installment of Just Show Me on Tekka TV, where we take your tech toys and gadgets and show you how to get the most out of them. Today I'm going to show you how to import photos onto your Windows 7 device. Archiving your pictures is a really important process because A, you definitely want to have them backed up to a hard drive on your computer, and B, you want to go ahead and make sure that you've got plenty of space on your camera to take more pictures. So let's get our pictures imported on Windows 7. Sometimes your computer will have a card reader built in. And if that's the case, you can use the camera's SD card and directly put it into your machine. If not, that's okay. You can use your camera's connection cable, which comes with your camera, and you can plug it right in. Usually it's a USB connection. So let's plug it in to our Windows 7 laptop. Now once we've done that and turned the camera on, you'll see that a pop-up message will come up saying autoplay. And there'll be a whole bunch of different options for you. And the first option is pictures options, import, pictures and videos. That's what we're looking for. So let's choose that. And you can see that it will give us a very nice import pictures and videos window. And right here, we can actually tag these pictures. So uh, I want to tag them as Santa Monica. So if I'm ever looking for these pictures on my computer, I know I can search by tag, which is pretty cool. And if you would like to change your import settings, you can click on import settings there in the window and you'll get a whole bunch of options. You can choose where you would like your pictures to go to, where you would like your video to go to, uh, what you would like it to automatically name the folder, what you would like the file name to have. So it'll, and it'll actually give you an example of exactly what it will look like, which is really nice. So you can do that. And once you're done with all of those things, you can actually hit OK. And then from the import pictures and videos pop up, you just press import. And if you would like Windows to erase what's on your SD card after it's done importing, all you have to do is just check that box that says erase after importing and it will automatically delete those pictures from your camera's memory. Now once your pictures are done importing, you can find them very easily by going over to Explorer, which is the folder in the bottom left side of your screen and looking under My Pictures in the left hand sidebar. It's that easy to import your pictures into Windows 7. That's been Just Show Me on Tekka TV. Be sure to check out Tekka.com for all of our other content, and we'll see you next time.